in places like this, there's always something to look at. Places like this are vital for humans to explore their own nature. And, and for me, that's art. There's some, there's some places like this place we're at now where it really feels like it's always been like this. And you can travel back in time. You can kind of see how nature was before us. And it's almost a reminder of, of what, what harmony in nature looks like. There is an element of surprise that I find within my own work. There's always something else that catches your eye. And I think the nature of seeing is something that I find very similar to the process of, of painting, to sculpture, to drawing. Seeing is almost like an unfinished drawing. You're always continuing the line. You're always looking for something new. There's always something new to see. There's always something new that catches the eye. And I think it's important for work to also feel alive, the same way we experience seeing in, in nature. The job of an artist is to, to fi continue to find inspiration even after uh, great work has been made. An experience as an artist is not really about finishing work to its fullest completion, but leaving it at a place where other work can grow out of it. Many things in life should be unfinished because there's always something else to start. I'm not always uh, sure of my work. Sometimes I am, but some, when, I, when I'm not, that somehow is a new beginning. I think that this is a game that's also for us, you know, spiritually to, to be able to evolve visually, to create languages, and to find a new love for seeing. For me, a painting can be about moving your eye through it and maybe some things are meant to be a little hidden. My grandmother in Norway left me with something that I think about a lot. It's always good to have something that you can always see something new in.